start and a shorter time frame um, thank God it is September uh, seasons coming down to a want uh, in and uh, hopefully everybody's had a great season out there we have had one of the most productive seasons in the four years that we have been in business we're going into the fifth season after this year and uh, actually the third winter and um, so we only been doing winter stuff for three years this will be our third season with winter but yeah so we're going into our closing out our fourth uh, season and wow wow is all I can really say is that it was one productive great season very very awesome season and uh, Thank you, dude. And, uh, yeah, we have grown by leaps and bounds. We actually started the season with uh, 135 properties, end up with 185. That's our total count right now. And we're still adding some. Um, as everybody knows, and, and if you don't know, if you're new to this uh, channel, thank you for subscribing. Thank you for watching. But, um, we only service our little town, and it is approximately six square miles that we only service, and a um, little, little bit over six square miles. So, but needless to say, we only service our little town, and um, yeah, it, it it really pays off to only serve our little area. And obviously, you guys see we're still adding trucks. By the third truck this year. Uh, Sierra and I, Sierra's mowing full time, I'm mowing full time. We both uh, chip in on the landscaping, and uh, if we need the help, we, we got a guy that'll come and help us do the landscaping. Now, next year, we're going to switch gears a little bit and um, going to probably hire a couple guys. And um, Sierra and I are going to pretty much take more of an uh, administrative role try to get out of the trucks um, but I'm in no big hurry no big hurry at all so what it is um, the lawn care news is taking off it's going off crazy without a hitch and um, actually I had a couple guys reach out to me but one big guy has reached out to me and uh, honestly I'm very humbled that he even speaks to us the way he does and uh, Brian from Brian's Lawn Maintenance. Wow, great guy, great freaking channel, a lot of information. He's been going through it too this year. He's growing and uh, he's learning something new every day as well. And uh, that's what it's about. He, he's a hustler, he's a true hustler. And um, yeah, he reached out to us about the lawn care news and gave me some uh, friendly advice. And um, we're going to start using that advice. And, the, and one is just in our SEO work and the description. I'm going to start breaking down the um, the segments of the show. That way everybody understands and sees what's inside of the show. They know what's going on. And um, I, I think that obviously it'll help because, I mean, people are watching. They just, a lot of people don't watch it all the way because they don't know what everything is in time. It, entailing inside of the show so if you guys haven't checked out one of those shows 
sit through one right now and uh, definitely get some laughs. Uh, it, it, it's some information, but mainly um, we we, uh, we toss in the information joke with the info. You know, you know how that goes. So that that's kind of how we run that. And um, but we still keep the information flowing through there. If you would like some information tossed on there about your company, let us know. I ain't got no problem pumping your channel. I got no problem pumping anything as long as I can stand behind you. And, um, and, and we can stand behind your work, and so to say. Because um, I'm not about to pump some rag bag. And, and not at all. Not at all. So, Brian's, Brian from Brian's Lawn Maintenance. I know you're from Michigan up there, buddy. So, uh, and technically speaking, I probably should not even be talking to this guy right now for a couple more months after the Ohio State Michigan game but right now he's a great guy and um, he has been on top of us on top of me like like no other man and, and he watches our channel he might not make a lot of comments uh, might not make any at all here and there but uh he, he always hits me up on Instagram with some great info and uh, try to help me out. Him and, and that mower man, David Austin Nego or whatever. I don't even know his last name. David uh, out there in Texas. Mower man. He hits me up too, man. Those, those two guys, they, they they mess with me. I'm not sure why, but they do. And, and I love it. And I take all their information that they're giving me. And uh, I try to apply it to a lot of things. So, um getting back into the swing of things as far as um, making more videos uh, mowing videos work videos stuff like that I am NOT publishing them right now I'm not posting them at all I am actually saving them and I'm gonna wait until November November time frame uh, right when our season starts ending and that's when I will start dropping our our work videos more um fall cleanups stuff like that mowing right now in september uh finishing out the season new clients stuff like that i'm gonna toss one in here and there just to keep the mix going but um right now you guys are gonna be seeing a lot of the news uh segments and um just hang in there man you know i'm gonna keep it funny you know i'm gonna drop in some commercials here and there but uh I'm going to do a little bit more vlogging as far as talking um, on those, but right now I'm trying to save all the work videos just because uh, I'm not trying to be inside of that crowd right now. Um, I'm trying to post ours when people aren't posting shit. If we mow for three of those four out of that fire engine. Um, yeah, that's cool. So, we'll be there today, Scott Burris. Um, all right, so, yeah, guys, just hang hang back, sit back, relax, and, uh, yeah, that's what's up. So, how do you guys deal with this cold weather, man? I'm not a cold weather kind of guy. I don't like the cold weather. Uh, today, it is 52 right now. Uh, when I woke up, it was 47. Um, 52 right now. So, uh... I want to know how you guys deal with the cold weather. I'm just not a cold weather kind of guy. Um, don't like it at all. I, quite frankly, I hate it. So, how you guys do deal with it? And uh, do you wear anything different? Do you have different uniforms? Do you wear a lot of sweatshirts? What do you guys wear? Because uh, I'm a sweatshirt and BDU kind of guy. I wear my old school uh, military winters and um wear my summers but yeah i, I wear my bdus or, so uh dcus i got them all but my bdus is where I, that's my fallback right there and um i really like those and uh they keep me warm but here a couple months i'll go to the carhartt pants then the carhartt jumpers uh, i live in those all winter so hate the cold hate 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 the cold so guys how do you do with winter and uh how's everyone's season going man we're right there we're, we're right there everybody sees the light so um 
Hopefully everybody's had a great season. I'll be back. Everyone have a good day. One love.